Ghouls, ghosts, goblins, and more. What else could the community of Greene County want out of the third annual Haunted Con? It's Greene County's premier all-day paranormal event. Speakers discussed all things paranormal throughout the day, including ghosts, cryptids, psychic abilities, and more. Greene County local and organizer of the day, Kevin Paul, was one of the speakers. Paul spoke on his two books, Haunted Hills and Hollows, What Lurks in Greene County, Pennsylvania, and Haunted Hills and Hollows 2, Still Lurking in Greene County, Pennsylvania. I'm going to give an overview of both books and then kind of hit on the, the Celtic connection in the last chapter of the second book. It has to do with Irish folklore and um, I know there's been a lot of stuff kicked around in the presentations, but I'm, I'm leaning towards um, a lot of these entities uh, communicate quite effectively with humans. It's just that we're not paying attention because it's all done in signs and metaphors um, because we don't speak a common language. While Paul's discussion mainly focused on folklore, other presenters such as Brian Seach were more focused on cryptozoology. According to Seach, events like this allow people to share sightings with not only other believers, but the researchers as well. I think it's important that we get out, all, all of us, all of the researchers here, that we get out and we tell people what we've seen so they can actually feel better about coming to someone that, hey, I saw this giant ape-like creature in the woods, who do I talk to? There are people you can, that, that they can talk to, and we want to talk to you, whether it be my group or another group. Uh, it's important to get those those sightings out there. It doesn't do any good if uh, somebody's seen something and won't talk about it. Stan Gordon, author and film producer, said there's a lot of local interest in the paranormal due to how active Greene County is. Well, I think one reason is there's a lot of interest around here because there's a lot of sightings. Uh, Greene County and all the surrounding areas, uh, Armstrong, uh, Washington, Westmoreland, Fayette, Indiana, Allegheny, reports come in from these areas year after year. Western Pennsylvania is a known hot spot for paranormal activity, but Kevin Paul's book solidifies the title of most haunted county in America as Green County. And we don't know what we don't know what these things are. No, no one really knows what these things are. Don't let them kid you; they don't, including me. There's still a lot of unanswered questions surrounding the haunted, and a lot of her mysteries remain unsolved. For Channel 14 News, I'm Rebecca Vaughn.